Welcome to Let's Play Cars Meta National Championship Episode 35 And since we have now done All four of the available story mode races we can do Including the team relay when I say that It is now time for us to get on with the mini games part of the game, which means, of course, that we have to do the fuel frenzy challenges and also the final three race and chase challenges. So, I've not driven anywhere, obviously, since I uh, just booted up the game, and all it is that I'm going to do now is just make it over to the checkpoint. <laughs> yes, you're one of the twins, aren't you? Alright, let's do this. So we have just three Fuel Frenzy challenges remaining. I think this is on the Pro difficulty, if I'm not mistaken. And oddly enough, that is uh, just the way I want it to be, because, well, I really don't want this to take too long. And well, the fuel challenges actually aren't too difficult, it's just a matter of knowing if you can uh, manage to save the bigger fuel canisters for when you need them later on in the run. So, same instructions as before, and this time we get three bolt banner points if we can manage to complete three laps around this circuit. Beat this level to win the golden gas can. Alright, let's do this. And we shall see how we go. Hopefully this will not be a complete whitewash. And already Fred is barging in. Quite rudely, I might add. Trying, of course, to uh, save up these medium canisters about as much as I can, and obviously not taking to the gravel because I have a feeling that would uh, just slow me down. And of course, I am keeping my uh, available tanks of fuel available to me, because I figured that, of course, would be the obvious choice. And already Mater has been caught out by the shrew, and obviously it's not necessarily a race against the AI, it's more of a race against the fuel tank. I do know how to get this done, and already Mater once again barging in, quite rudely, I might add, considering that's uh, more or less just the nature of the AI. And, and you know, at the moment, considering the circumstances, I'm actually doing very well at the moment. There's a large canister there, but obviously I'm not going to use it straight away, because I may need that. And not going to use any of these babies up, at least not immediately. Because I know very well that for the purposes of legality, I prefer to keep my available canisters intact. Because that is what I do. I try to keep them with me, even then of course if I'm- oh! Damn it! Yep, okay, it's all happening now. Everything is happening to me which can potentially go wrong up to this point. 
everything which is going wrong at the moment is now officially going wrong. Or everything which can go wrong now already is going wrong. Alright, anyways. Not going to waste any time, just going to build up my speed on the ramp and apparently the AI are not taking to the outside lane for fuel and apparently it might be they're not jumping for a typer which uh, which is able to uh, bode in my favour and alright here we go white flag alright here we go white flag one lap to go and then we are done with this and yes, I am dubbing this as being the white flag lap. Because that's basically what this is. White flag, one more time around. The wheel well circuit. And I do stay on course. As of which, obviously, I do of course have to uh, jump for those canisters if I am to... Uh, and them. I made up some good time to save them until now. We are doing quite well at the moment, and collecting whatever canisters are available to me, not missing out on any available opportunities towards getting the larger ones just basically aiming for them. Oh, okay. Yep. Okay, it's all happening now. Basically everything at the moment is happening. Basically, everything at the moment is happening to me. Anyways, there we go. Three laps have been set, and don't need to collect any more fuel. And since I am doing this on the pro difficulty, don't really see too much of a point in going for a fourth lap. I don't really think I need to fuel up up to this point, even though I probably will collect some canisters whilst I'm here, just to get that a little bit further. See if I can make it to 13.4 miles. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll be happy with that. <laughs> I guess that's just the reward you get for being in conservation mode. Even though I did of course do this on the uh, the pro difficulty, not the champion difficulty. So three bolt banners and ultimately we still have another 90 left to claim, although I would imagine most of them are ultimately in the uh, in the final two races of the game, since I would imagine that's probably where we're going to get most of them. Anyways, let's move onwards to... our second challenge in the uh, fuel frenzy of this game. And what exactly is our next circuit called? Oh yeah, the upper mine. Okay. So, we still have two levels left to beat, and then once we have done that, that should be the fuel frenzy done and dusted. 
And then, once we've done that, we can focus on the capitalization of going for the remainders. Alright, so same objective as before. Still three bolt banners if we can do this. And to setting three laps around a circuit called the Upper Mine. And already getting an early start, as of which I do know the AI are just literally going to gobble up. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this one. I really cannot afford to hit those mine carts. Because they could be an interference. At least that depends on my current situation. Well, keeping myself in contention at least. I don't want to use them up too much, or at least I don't want to use the important ones too early. I just want to uh, keep a hold of them, which is more or less what my uh, primary objective is. Just basically trying to save the. Uh, more important canisters for when I need them most. And I'm just hitting everything at the moment. And okay, I think I hit a top speed of 175 through there whilst I was uh, airborne. I think that was the speed I hit. Although, at the moment, I'm basically hitting everything. Again, not racing the AI, just basically racing myself to the completion. Of three laps around the circuit. And... I would imagine that's probably going to be the same for Canyon Run as well, considering that will probably... I think that might be a glitch effect there with the uh, debris that was left over from one of the previous minecarts that was hit. Yep, okay. Okay, it is all happening to me at the moment. Not exactly the way I want it to be. No, at least I can say I'm keeping myself in check. Well, not really racing the AI up to this point. I'm just going to uh, stick to the uh, normal route. Even though I may not necessarily get as much fuel. At the very least, I am still managing, of course, To more or less obtain, oh, and made to collect the large canister. Oh, there you go. Well, there's one of my plans out the window. Well, there's one of my plans out the window. I think I can happily say that's one of my plans out the window. Just literally gone with the wind. Ask me. Right, I got my first large canister. Although I think that was probably my second. Well, whatever. I'm not keeping track on uh, how many gas cans I've got up to this point. 
I'm really not keeping up to date with uh, how many I've already collected. Alright, white flag. One lap to go, sponsored by Credit One Bank. Since apparently that is a meme with uh, NASCAR's white flag lap. White flag, one lap to go, sponsored by Credit One Bank. I tend to do a lot of crushing when I do this sort of thing. At least when I'm trying to keep myself on track. Yep, okay. Everything is happening to me at the moment. Is just keep occurring at the moment. They're virtually unavoidable. Also, the other reason why I put this on the pro difficulty is simply because, well, I didn't want my USB to stock up again since it's more or less been uh, doing that sort of thing a lot, a lot recently. Anyways, continuing. With my efforts of setting a record which is ascertainable. I'm running very well at the moment, by the way. Oh, yep, yeah, okay. Yeah. I think probably myself not scraping the guardrails, that might be an optional choice. I don't think I need to just keep slamming into the guardrails like I have been doing. And there goes my turn. Oh well. I mean, well, I'm basically just going to keep going until my uh, gas tank is uh, gone anyway. I'm not really interested in completing. Not really that interested in completing four laps, in all honesty. I just want to continue until I've uh, just emptied out the fuel tank. Somehow I've still not hit a minecart, which surprises me. Well, anyways. Well, almost made it to four laps, but it's fine. Doesn't matter. What, first place again? No! You're a model of taste and conservation.
Yeah, thanks for that, Velma. Anyways, I set my three laps, I got my three bolt banners. And so, let's now move onwards to our final fuel, thren fuel frenzy challenge in this game, which takes place on the canyon run. Although, the only thing I'm really hoping for is that the boulders do not cause so much of a problem that I literally, so much of a problem that it literally just feels like trying to put out a fire in a nuclear power plant. Because I'm very much aware of knowing what exactly could go wrong if I... Do not pay attention to the most sufficient details. Anyways, it is now time for the final level of Fillmore's Fuel Frenzy. And then, once we've done this, that shall be another minigame complete. Alright, let's do this. And are we on the canyon run for this one? I got a feeling that says we are. Oh yeah, we are definitely on the canyon run for this one. Well, at least I can say there's a reason for me to, um... At least I can say there is... A reason for me to, uh... Only do three laps around the circuit and not four. There is definitely a good reason for this. And... I still don't know how exactly you are meant to take that jump, but... I'm sure there's a way to do it somehow. I'm just not sure on what that is. Oh, yeah. And what exactly it is I'm uh, meant to accomplish by doing that. Although, oddly enough of course, winning the race itself to me personally, was was already bad enough, but yet having to actually set, but yet having to actually set a total of uh, three laps around the circuit, around a circuit such as this one, that only just makes this even more of an ordeal. In complete honesty. Towards everything, which has basically happened to me whenever I've driven this circuit. Although fortunately, I do not have to drive flat out. Although, fortunately this time, I do not have to drive flat out. Also, by the way, trying to win this race on the uh, champion difficulty, that is a real bitch. You've got to believe me when I say that. Because it really is. Yep, here come the boulders. Here comes chaos. As I would have anticipated. As I would have anticipated it to get here. As I would have very well anticipated it to get here. One yeah, point. okay. I was well off. Yeah! Well, at least I can say there were fuel canisters on the rejoin, so that's... not too much of a problem. So, at the moment, that's actually not too much of a problem. Anyways, continuing to set the marks. Alright. One lap is in the books. Just depends on knowing if I am able to 
do all the other laps without too many problems. Anyways, continuing with the fuel mileage run and also keeping my uh, most important canisters intact because that does exist for a reason. And through here we go. And apparently the AI did not opt to take that shortcut on the previous lap. Although, at the moment of course, I have no idea where, where the AI are in comparison to me. Because I am a long way ahead of the AI at the moment. Trust me, I really am. I mean, if this was a three lap per then I... I mean, if, they, if this was an actual circuit race, I would literally be dominating the way I see it. Although then again, I am doing this on the uh, pro difficulty, not champion. And oddly enough, I'm actually getting used to using the power slides. I figure those are important now. At least, on certain courses, I've noticed, it's important. Yep, okay, here comes chaos again. Which is... Which is inevitably trying to, uh, destroy me. Somehow, that did not go any worse than it did. And, not gonna waste it. Not gonna take any chances, just gonna literally rocket my way across the jump. Basically, skyrocket, to be more specific. So, two laps are now on the board, and we just need one lap left. So, one lap remains. White flag, one lap to go, sponsored by Credit One Bank. <laughs> At least I think that's uh, how the beam works. But anyways, yeah, I'm using NASCAR memes. And it's also because, fortunately, the one person who is not watching over me is Kyle Bush. Oh. Haha, I gotcha. <laughs> you ain't getting away from me that easy. And well, I probably will do uh, champion runs for each of the uh, for each of the fuel frenzies. If I get a chance to do so, I probably will do the um, the fuel frenzies. Probably will do the fuel frenzy runs on the champion difficulty at some point if I feel like it. Just to uh, show, of course, that I have some capabilities. Even then, of course, if at the moment it's not many. But yeah, I mean the AI, the AI at the moment, from what I can sympathise, they're literally nowhere near me. I honestly don't even think I can see them in my rearview mirrors. So, I must be way out in front if I cannot see them or hear them. I guess that's just how much I'm uh, coming to dominate this thing. Or just, you know, getting used to the uh, domination of this thing. <laughs> that was probably the longest power slide I've had for pretty much this entire game. 
Probably because I remember to use throttle control. Probably because I managed to use throttle control. Not missing this one. I need it. Just shooting my way across, or bulleting my way across, I should say. And all right. So just less than point one of a lap to go, and then we should be all done. And up to the line. And there we go. All I need to do now is just go a little bit further and then just wait and see how long it is before... before I run out of gas. Since I've already met my minimum target. I'll just collect a little more. See if I can make it to 3.2. Alright, there we go. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay. Well, I've got I've got a little bit of gas left, but let's just wait and see how long this will take us. Can I get up to 3.3? Yes, I can. I've just reached the 3.3 mile mark, and I'm just going to slam on the brakes. Yep. I'd say we're about done here. Yeah, use it. Don't abuse it. Anyways, I win. <laughs> so three bolt banner points, and ultimately, that should now be all of our. Fuel frenzy levels done and dusted. And just going to watch over my USB just to make sure it does not stock up again. As of which it's been doing that a lot recently since I started playing this game. So I am just, uh, you know, being wary of these things. Hopefully it'll stay on record for this bit. There you are, hot stuff! Great! Thanks, Lizzie! Yep, I'm gonna have to do some download. I'm gonna have to do some audio downloads in order to uh, <coughs> officially get the audio I need. Because apparently. There are certain cutscenes where my copy of the game does decide to play the audio, and then other times it doesn't. But yeah, that's all of our uh, fuel frenzy challenges done and dusted. And all we need to do now is finish off the race and chase challenges, which will be happening next time. Stay tuned for more of the Mater National.